Traitor Gaming! Hello everybody, I'm Zero. My wife is back here fighting my phone, so if you hear anybody swearing, it's her. I just wanted to show everybody that not only Raider gets cool toys in the mail, I get cool toys in the mail. And let's see what I got. I'm probably a few years late with this, but contrary to popular opinion, Assassin's Creed Unity was really good. And I liked Arno a whole lot, and his little gauntlet thing was really cool to me. And I finally could afford to buy one, so it did. Let's see what it does. I get a code for the game, even though I haven't even played the new one really, so I'm probably not gonna go back and play Unity anymore. But regardless, hidden crossbow is cool. I might have to fight Raider with his crossbow. Check out the box. I can put that on display. This is the Phantom Blade Kit. It was really good. Well, I got it from the Ubisoft store. So it better be good. Good thing about living in Arkansas is you always have a knife. So for whatever reason you didn't play the game and you're watching me unbox this toy, what he had was not only an extended blade thing, but it also has a crossbow attached to it. I'm assuming this is the bolt. Right there. Bonfire! <laughs> 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 So, uh, let you guys look at it a little bit before I play with it on my own terms. The actual gauntlet came with, I guess, three separate pieces, if you want to call it that. Came with the gauntlet here, which it goes on the bottom of the wrist. This is how they do it in the game. Then you have the top part of the gauntlet, which goes over the top of your arm right here. Quite like that and it just makes it look more like a glove. Gives it that good looking vibe. Anyway, and then it came with the bolt. Uh, I was worried because I'm a little bit immature, as you can, as you can tell. So yeah, as I was saying, the bolt is squishy. You can bend it, it's very malleable. You just stab the camera with it a little bit, and it's, you know, it's pretty squishy. So, you can shoot it at people, and it doesn't go to very good velocity. It doesn't go to very high velocity, because it want to sound smart in front of people. It won't hurt too bad. The blade, on the other hand, does. It'll do a little pokey poke. So, we'll go more into depth on the actual, like, <laughs> gauntlet itself. It looks pretty good for being a prop, as you can tell. The crossbow comes out like a this. That's a little middle button. The bolt will shoot pressing the assassin's button there. And then the blade comes out pressing the button on the bottom. You can press it to your hip and it'll come out. You can look all cool and mean and scary. If you want to load the thing, which I had to learn because I'm an idiot, the bolt has two little divots at the back. You focus. You focus. Okay. And you place them into the folded crossbow as so with the divots facing the thing, pull it down with the bolt and we'll click and you press the little A. Look. <laughs> so yeah, all in all I paid like 30 bucks for it and it's pretty cool, I think, you know. It's kind of bulky because of the crossbow, but what do you expect? So yeah, that was the Phantom Blade from Assassin's Creed Unity, Arno's signature weapon. The only thing is I wish that when I click, like click out loud, boom, like that. And the buttons are a little fidgety. 
But yeah, if you like this video, give us a huge thumbs up. If you have something to say, leave a comment down in the comments section and subscribe if you haven't already. Be sure to check our description for a code for tblocks.com. You'll get 15% off your first month subscription. They're a great company. They give you great things. Definitely check those out. Thank you guys so much for watching and goodbye.